Okay. Okay. Three, two, one. Okay, everybody. So today we're um. Ugh, let's start it over. That's fine. And you need to wait a couple seconds anyway before you start. After you count. Then I guess you should have let let this if you know so much. Well, I'm just talking about the counting. I guess you should have okay. let this. Three, two, one. All right, everybody. So today we're doing a winter holiday tag. Um, we have questions about books as well as just the holiday season in general. So I'm going to start with the first question. What is your favorite book taking place during Christmas or the winter? Oh, favorite book? Hmm. The thing about me is that I've only read like romances. I'm, so, I'm trying to think. But the wait, the favorite. Oh, what is the favorite book? I'm, I thought you were talking about the place. Okay, what is your favorite book? Oh, I don't really have a favorite book that play, take place during the winter. But I'm gonna say like a Harry Potter one. Like, what's the one that took place during Christmas? I was gonna say that too, and it's so annoying because like, why is that so magical? That's that's the thing. It's just so it's like, so memorable. I, I have to be there. I want to be there in Hogsmeade. See, yeah, it has to be. I want to see where it, all though? the crimes went down. But which one is it that took? They had a Christmas, like basically all of them, like the first one I know, third year. They, it's like they've always been there during winter time. No, of course, but I thought there was one where like it was about Christmas. No, literally none of them. Oh, you mean year four? Is it year four? They what? had the Yule Ball. Maybe. Oh no, they. I bet they got bomb ass sweets yeah that's the problem you like i have such a sweet tooth like just take me away really i don't really care for it just chocolate so and they have that's chocolate I, frogs and that's the only thing i eat something else that's chocolate. So sweet. I don't. chocolate frogs and something this is not right here potter um <laughs> anyways like they decorate so well and it's like that's why i just yeah. gotta be there Th those trees the, like I, like some fairies like the little fairy light things oh my gosh the snow you know they snow is real yeah what yeah we don't got no snow here well why would we have fake snow exactly okay. because we don't got none okay okay don't me. number two okay what fictional place would you want to spend christmas from a book and that's that's my answer again yet again i want to do like hogsmaid or the forest of was it forest of dean when they were on the run <laughs> um but they had no food like like good food unlike if you were at school like where they went all out where they got the food from magic no you can't conjure food really i honestly didn't know that what the hell it defies the laws of what is the laws laws of is it gam or something but it's part of like transfiguration you cannot conjure something that doesn't already exist you too deep in it Zara. Too <sighs> that's the problem <laughs> okay mine is different actually i would want to spend um christmas okay so from my haul i i read a book um the 12 days of christmas and it takes place in edinburgh scotland yes i would want to spend christmas there because first of all um a lot of it's set uh they have the guy the main male character he has like a bakery you know i love a cute little bakery especially they you don't know, do little seasonal christmas things i would visit there every morning get a little coffee and like little christmas tree um and it's in edinburgh and i want to visit there you know also took place in edinburgh what what <laughs> don't say it when, what happened you know what happened to covey oh oh not she's my black cake oh yeah, yeah she wasn't there long um anyway question three. <laughs> oh my god no what is your favorite christmas movie from childhood why are you smiling because i have an answer Ooh, go ahead you want me to go first okay i have two and you're probably gonna be like feel so nostalgic when i say this but one is a cartoon and mine is i'm trying to remember felix the cat saves that! christmas oh my god zaria oh my god we used to watch that all the time because we had it on dvd used Oof. to we used to watch it every time um, like every christmas or i used to watch it like not on christmas <laughs> and then my other one is a carol christmas with tori spelling 
I was gonna say, oh my god, I was just thinking of her too. I also like um the the movie with Oh oh my god Queen Latifah. What the fuck is wrong with me? My other favorite one I watch every year is This Christmas. Oh <laughs> This Christmas with Chris Brown and the short and all the black people. <laughs> all <laughs> the black people. No, I like the one with Queen Latifah. Last holiday. Last holiday. I love Last Holiday as well. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. Love Christmas movies. So this Christmas, Felix uh, the Cat Saves Christmas, A Carol Christmas, and Last Holiday. Now, we have not said anything that was like very mainstream, like Elf. I don't care. I don't either. It's all right. I, d I don't even remember it. Like, Me I've never watched Home Alone. I don't care. Um, I've never watched Home Alone. And there's like four movies. I do want to see Die Hard. They do say that's the Christmas movie. Or did it come out on a Christmas day? That's them. Um, I do want to see some newer holiday movies like Violent Night or mm -hmm. is it Violent Delight? Whatever. One of them hoes. But yeah, I feel like that that's not gonna be like a Christmas classic. I guess yeah, y'all you also don't have this shoes a Christmas classic, but Yeah, but like, like, I don't Night. care about those. Me neither. Like the ones that they maybe like, keep talking about. It's like And it's not even that I don't different. care. It's just that I definitely grew up on these movies beforehand. So they're always gonna be in my heart. Mm -hmm. A Carol Christmas that came out in like let me see 2003 Felix oh my gosh 2003 and then Felix the cat one came out in 2004 fantastic movie and we had on DVD mm -hmm. I feel like there was some other ones that we also had we had a I few just more do not remember mm. okay uh what is your favorite holiday drink slash meal oh my gosh I love a good peppermint mocha mm -hmm. drink mm -hmm. coffee hot chocolate um meal I'm not sure I have a meal that uh like favorite Christmas one. I'm not sure I have a meal for that, but I do. I mean something that we've like had like in childhood or like recently. But what do we always have? Well, like what's yours? Well, I mean, do you have one? Mac and cheese, I guess. I know all I can think of is mac and cheese. But exactly, that's like, because I also make... our our tastes have changed. Like we're vegetarian, so we don't have like ham or no. But even roast then, like. Turkey? Um, whatever that is. Wait, what's your favorite holiday? I was, I'm trying, I thought like holiday specific. I mean, because but when you think of holiday, you do think of yeah. Christmas, New Year's. Yeah, but there's nothing I like always, awesome. always made except for like mac and cheese. Carrot souffle? Carrot souffle, sweet potato pie, some type uh, of green. Uh, carrot souffle. That, but that's just like our holiday dishes that I always make. Exactly. Okay, I mean, yeah, I can Stop say that. right now. Well, you you just asked me for my menu then. No. Basically, but my favorite holiday specific drink is peppermint mocha, like anything. Mine too. However, I do love, what's the, like, when people add, like, gingerbread. Okay, stuff, yeah. Gingerbread. Stuff like that. Gingerbread chai, like, latte, stuff like that. Ooh. Yeah, exactly. That's good. But it's like, I don't really get anything else during the holidays besides that. Yeah. Should probably switch it up these days. You know, you don't have I to. do like hot, hot chocolate though. Yeah, I did too. I had two today. Really? When did you make the first one? I only saw you drinking the second time. During breakfast. Oh, I had coffee. Okay, what does your dream winter holiday look like? Where you spend it, what would you do? Um, dream winter holiday? Duh. I don't really know. My only my thing is that I just like looking at Christmas lights. Like I don't care about any else, anything else. Like we can go somewhere snowy. It doesn't really matter. New York, Colorado, um, London, whatever. Wh whoever snows. <laughs> Edinburgh, if you will. Um, I just like looking at Christmas lights and Christmas displays. That's true, but also you don't have to travel for that. So it's like I meant dream better. What do you mean? As a dream winter holiday, as in like somewhere you would want to go. During the winter. Yes. Yeah, that's what I'm saying though. Like I don't have a dream winter holiday. Okay. Like I would want to go anywhere where it's snowing that has like a lot of like even like um Is it Iceland that has the Oh my god, I wanna go to Iceland so bad. The light thing? So does Alaska. Oh no, I don't know Alaska. But Iceland oh, no. probably. But no offense to anyone who lives in Alaska, but that's somewhere I would never go. Sorry. never really it's dark there i heard they got gangs there exactly they have a very high crime rate from what i remember you know what also what i want to do is go sledding like one time 
You see, I'm afraid of falling. Okay. Well, like, if don't there's fall. a like, steep... I see. Anyways, mine would take place in like a Scandinavian country. Okay, example. I would stick out like a sore ass thumb. But like, um, like Finland. Okay, yeah. Oh my gosh. Denmark. I want to go oh, there yeah, so true. bad. You know they're happy. And I know it would look so pretty. You probably, they probably just do it up there. Um, what, what would I, what do I do? I guess I would just go around like the countryside maybe. Mm -hmm. Cause you know they got countryside everywhere. Uh, I mean, yeah, I know. Yeah, Cause I know it's like, it's very, probably very airy there. Oh, maybe Ireland. I'm thinking Ireland too. Okay. Cause they got a lot of greenery, but like probably like really nice with snow. I just, I just need like a really nice Christmas display, like light display. I mean, you should literally find that like no but like like around here like some people just have lights up but i need like you know little candy canes like the you know i just need like the other things to go so you want to see people with money I, that's what you say <laughs> if it has to be you know what i mean if they have to be i don't know how people do that though it's like i know light bills are just sky high risk it all no not for this what book would you want to receive for christmas um I mean, I don't really want to receive books for Christmas unless I know, unless that person knows. Good thing. No, no, no. Unless that person knows, like, okay, let me look at her TBR and here's a book. How would I get access? Well, I'm just, I'm I know, just like, I was going It's not to about you. <laughs> it's not about you, but if you try to say you was trying to get me a book for Christmas. I was so trying to, but then I was like, you don't deserve it. Um, Just because it's like, if I don't, if they don't, if they don't know my taste, that's the problem. So that's I why I wouldn't want to receive it just in case if they got me the wrong one. But... If I had to get a book, I would just say something like a a limited edition version of something. Girl, that's money, nigga. Like, come on. No, either, no, I'm saying like either, no, like either, I like could just say like the, tw like a 2023 version of this, like something like that. Like I would want like a really one that's like either a sign or really nice updated cover, like a limited edition type thing. Like mm -hmm. I, like I've seen the, um, uh, a YouTube short of the, the Cinder, the, that series. Oh my god! And gosh. it had really nice covers. Yes. And you like, already have you've read the books, but like if you wanted the like I'm like oh my gosh, this looks really nice, and this is like you know edition. who has really nice editions? Fairy loot. Oh okay, like, yes. You, okay. Oh my! I would want something like I know it's expensive, like just getting a subscription from them, but like there's like covers are so beautiful yeah that's what i'm saying oh my god like it'd have to be a book that i've already read right because it's like what if i don't want this shit and then you spend all this money that's what i'm saying T. but um i have a very large tbr so it'd be very hard to like look for like you'd have to like get some access and like obviously there's i also have books that haven't even come out yet on my tbr really <laughs> yes but that make it easier to get a book for you because we're like oh she most likely has this on her tbr whereas me like mine is smaller but i have like specific tastes romance romance mystery. fantasy mystery like you do like fantasy i just remembered yeah we've had this conversation Thanks. i'm just remembering because like i you've mostly been picking up romance a lot well because winter romance is the easiest one because i wanted winter books but i'm like there's some death that takes takes place in like not in my books not in my books they don't <laughs> not my winter romances no they don't yeah but yeah it'd be very hard well I, you said it would be easy but it's like what if there's something i don't want to read at that moment though Say over 600 books my nigga. but you don't have to read at the moment you just have it That's no true. i know i didn't say it'd be easy i think it needs to be better. easier to get one for you just because you have such a large one that you could coincidentally get one that's on your um tbr no, because <laughs> what? <laughs> what do you mean, no? <laughs> no, there's no coincidence. Like, no, you need to look and actually look at. Oh, there's a the book she specifically added to her TBR. Let's get that one. Don't be just trying to throw something in the dark. No, but that's what I said. I said like, if you had a, if if I saw your TBR, like I could get a book for you or something like that. But I was saying like, if someone didn't, they could end up getting one of, of the books in your TBR just because you have like a large one of like 600, 700 or whatever. It's a, that's, it's bad. <laughs> People will have worse. So. I know. Well, not worse, but more. At least like I don't have like a gajillion like physical books unread. Yeah. All I, when I buy them, I do need to be better at just like trying to immediately read them because I don't want them to like. You don't have to be better dust. at that. Why not? Because I don't immediately read my books I get. But it's like, that's money I spend. 
You could read them down the line. I have books that I haven't but read. But I haven't, I still haven't gotten to them. I've gotten some books months ago. Still haven't mm -hmm. read. I've been like reading like library books. Oh yeah. Well, the library books are due. The ones you bought aren't. But I specifically checked them out. Like the library books. Oh, you books. Like, like afterwards. Oh, okay. Whoa. What? <laughs> okay. Last question. What are your favorite holiday traditions? Either you've done it in the past or you wish to do it. Okay, so first of all, the wish to do it. How you gonna wish to do a tradition? What do you mean? There's something like you wanna add, like do in the future, and, mm -hmm. like constantly do it. Like take a trip every winter holiday. See, 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 you thought you were gonna get me with this. Right, and I was actually gonna say the take a trip thing. <laughs> so I actually had an answer. I just wanted to cause problems. I'm sorry. <laughs> you are the problem. Chaos. Um, you are not the problem. My. First of all, our tradition that we usually do is we'll see Christmas lights. I do like seeing those. Oh, my tradition is that I always watch this Christmas. This Sometimes I won't watch it during Christmas. I'll watch it beforehand. Um, like, what? And what I want to do is probably... I want to, like, I tried to do this one year, like, make... I want to do, like, the Christmassy things or winter things. Like, we usually don't do that much besides, like, see lights and stuff like that. But I want to either like, like whether this be out of the state or out of the country or something, but like always go somewhere like how we want to go to Stone Mountain Park and they have like their Christmas display. Like I always want to like visit somewhere and do that. Like, yeah, see like a famous display. Yeah, like maybe. winter festival type of thing. Like That's just nice. see see like how they are. Um, I know some things are like in New York, like whatever their like annual thing is, like try to do that like all the time. So you still want to take a trip? That's what, that's what I'm hearing. No, I'm just saying something specific, like, like why? Because I know, like, um, like for our birthday, I was trying to look up things, and I want to do some. I wanted to do something like wintry, holiday-ish, but like because our birthday is late January, like everything ends beginning of January. Now you telling our business? It is what it is, Aquarius. Um, but they don't like all of it ends. So like, I want to try to do, like every year. Whether it's Georgia, Florida, like whatever they have, like Universal Studios. I don't think we've ever been there during Christmas. No, we haven't. But there's like we Bush during Chris not during our birthday. Okay, yeah, but there's like um, even Bush Gardens have things like even like a park or a national park, something with a Christmas Ooh, winter display national holiday. Park. Yeah. Make sure we're not alone. So like like Orient smashed. Express. If that's if that's a winter holiday type of thing, like I would want to do that like one year. I mean, yeah, I'll probably have to book those in advance because of course, because apparently what time of year was, oh, obviously it's winter in Orient Express and apparently like they, it was, it was filled. Oh, in the book. Yes. <laughs> but yeah. Um, so yeah, we, I, I do like going to see lights. I like being like, I'm glad that Georgia is cold around this time. Cause this wouldn't have happened in like Florida, so I do like feeling the winter air. Mm -hmm. That's a tradition I want to say. Feel the winter air. Yes, like okay. I want to be able to wear boots, my nigga. Like, come on. Mm -hmm. Um, and one day I would like to like take a like a annual trip to see like somewhere nice. Like I don't like I don't really understand how people just like during the winter not want to experience the winter. They want to go somewhere warm, and I'm like, yeah, I like. For fucking Cold. what? It's warm year round. Global warming. Um, right. Like, how about you go somewhere beachy during the summer? Not for me. But yeah, I would like to go somewhere. Um, yeah, see like snow. I want to, I've always wanted to see Northern Lights. Northern Lights. That's what I was talking about. Yes, Aurora Borealis. Where? Well, f I know Iceland. Or is it Norway? I think it's Norway. Okay. Um, One of those hoes. And also Alaska, but Alaska out of the Canada, I feel like they got something too. You could ask, but <laughs> oh. ask hey Canada. Do you got those? Um, but yeah, that's something I would want to do. Um, I don't know. They're like what? What's other stuff like? Because I don't care to build gingerbread houses. Like okay, um, I just feel like you heard me say I want to do that, and you is that what you said? You dissed me. Yeah, I don't recall. But I heard going. I said some gingerbread houses, uh-huh. Y'all, y'all, nigga. Diss me. Um, um, yeah, but that's really it. I don't really care to do this. I, I really just want to like go do like experiences, like. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Um, 
what I was gonna say is one thing we didn't mention and that I actually do like and I always felt like I looked like a character from this movie is the Polar Express. Do you though? The black girl that goes like. <laughs> <laughs> when I was younger, I kind of used to look like her. Did I not? I don't recall because I don't remember this movie. Oh, I've Polar Express? Oh, let me find Polar Express black girl. I bet you it come up. Look, Polar Express back up on train. On her. Train. Hey. They said Tanache played her. That's hilarious. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I let you zoom in. Isn't that how our hair used to look? Exactly. <laughs> and that was like more my skin tone too. When I was younger, I think. Um, now that one down looked like me. She looked a little crazy. <laughs> we getting crazy right there. That's not me, but. <laughs> uh, See, she my skin tone. She had a little highlight going on. <laughs> right. No, but that was all the questions. That was, that's, that's true. That's true. Um, yeah, I would like to do this again. That was winter holiday tag. Um, go ahead and answer the questions in the um, comments. I'd like to see what everybody got going on. Um, but you got anything to say to the people? No. You just mad because I don't want to bring on dinner for a house. Okay, I care about that. Um, nope, that's it for me. All right, well, anyways, like, subscribe, comment, and we'll see you next time. Thank you. Bye. Bye.